Mr. Larry Smith, and then Doc, you're in the you're in the shoot wherever you are. Uh, we got Mr. Larry Smith. He is a candidate for District 34. He's also a veteran. And I want to tell you, uh, you know, there, there are a lot of people in our movement that have a lot of animosity towards any kind of government, and, and that is understood. But what you need to understand is that there are people in our government that are oath keepers. And an oath keeper is a, is a person who signed up, took that oath, like myself, joined the military, and is absolutely committed to defending the Constitution and the people of the American country. And we would never turn our guns on an American citizen if ever ordered to do so. So uh, as, as, we, as we do that, just, just remember there are guys like uh, Mr. Smith here. He's running for Congress in District 34. He wants to make some change as well. Thanks a lot, Jim. All right, I got some questions for you. How many Democrats we got here? We got a Democrat. How many Republicans we got here? Yeah. All right. How many Americans? How many Americans do you have here? You know, the biggest problem in this country right now is we keep labeling each other. We keep calling each other out. August 2nd, 2004, two Americans were killed in an IED attack. Both called Route Huskies in West Baghdad. One was a kid named Harry Shondi, just turned 19 years old. The other was a guy named Justin Wardy, 26. Just got back two weeks before from seeing his youngest son born, or his first son born. One was an American Indian from New Mexico. The other was a black guy from Nigeria. They were not minorities. They were American soldiers. No one standing here is a minority. You are all Americans. Yeah. And until you start acting like Americans, you start treating each other like, like Americans, this country's wounds are not going to heal. We are exercising our rights today, right? What is the greatest protection of our constitutional freedoms? Wrong. Exercising your right to what? Vote. Vote. You can arm yourselves all you want with M16s and AR15s and bazookas for all I care. But if you are not registered and actively voting to prevent bad policy in this country from being scattered into our conservative communities and our successful conservative states, then you are hurting this country. You are showing up the battle without your gun. And you are a useless soldier. You, right here, right now, need to go back to where you came from, Dallas, San Antonio, Austin, East, West, Texas, and tell people, are you, ask them, are you registered to vote? And if they're not, say, you need to. We have men that have risked their lives, that have seen young American boys maimed and killed. And you are slapping us in the face if you are not standing up and doing your job as an American citizen. I protected this country. How many veterans we got? Raise your hands. We protected this nation against foreign enemies. It is up to us as citizen soldiers to protect it against bad domestic policy. My name is Larry Smith and I'm a congressional candidate for the 34th Congressional District of Texas. Thank you very much for your time.